We have this driver's logs for the month pulled up, and if we scroll down, we can see that he hasn't managed his logs very well for the last couple of days. Something's not quite right, and we can tell that because we can see these red lines to the left of the drive logs, and we can see that we have reasons for all of these violations that have popped up here. Now if we scroll over here and go to the graph, we can also see that any drive logs with violations show up with this red line underneath them, just to give us another visual cue that shows us that something's wrong. If we scroll down a little bit further, we can see what the problem was, and it's pretty obvious by looking at it that the driver forgot to log off the day before. Now that's a pretty easy fix. All we have to do is scroll to the top of the page, click the Add button. Now if we know that the driver was off on that day, this was Tuesday, and logged off, let's say, at 5 p.m., Make sure everything else looks good. It's the correct driver and truck automatically because we're correcting them right from the driver's logs. We'll choose an annotation. And now we can scroll up to the top and click Save. If we scroll down, we can see that the off log is still here, but the violations are also still in place. So what's the matter? Well, first of all, we have this yellow color on each of these auth logs. And what that indicates to us is that someone other than the driver, in this case us, edited the driver's logs. This is fine, but since the driver is ultimately responsible for his logs, the system is not going to recognize that edit until the driver goes in and accepts the change. As we can see, now that the driver has edited his log, everything is in white, and all of the violations on this next day have gone away. We can do the same thing for any other days where the driver missed his break or forgot to log off for the night.